what is going on everybody destroy here and today I have to tell you this is probably like the fourth time I've had to record this but I don't know why I keep I just keep running out of time so I'm gonna try and do this as quickly as possible basically in this video I may talk really fast at some points in time but that's because I really need to get this out there for everyone to know I'm gonna be showing you golf cart spawns you can see one here along the Alamo Sea there's two more I'm gonna show you in uh, Blaine County or Sandy Shores uh, next to Trevor's trailer or Ron's trailer and across the street from there now the reason I'm showing you this is because in GTA online sessions when you try to do something fun if you're playing in an open session and someone sees you having fun in most cases they try to take that away from you so if you're trying to drive a golf cart and online and someone saw that they would most likely try to come and kill you take that away from you or if they fail at that they will destroy the golf cart they're taking away what would be fun for you in GTA Online. So why I'm showing this video to you guys is so that you can find these golf carts in online sessions and have fun and you don't have to take them from people because I mean some of you might be the type of person where you'd kill someone if they had something that looked like it was fun and take it away. Now I'm not saying all of you like that or any of you are but there might be a few of you who have done that and you can't deny it because it's true. So this is a video where I show you where to get golf carts. Now you can't get them at the golf club or the golf club. Get them at the golfing range. I can't. The golf course. Couldn't think of it real quick. Um, those only spawn during the day at certain points in time. I don't think they spawn when it's raining. I don't think they spawn during the night. It has to be like a set time and they rarely spawn. But they will spawn there. Now, these are for the ones out in Blaine County. They both look exactly the same. They're terrible looking. So it doesn't matter where you get them from. They're all golf carts. And they all drive the same. But basically, why I made this video is because. I wanted to kind of talk about real quickly before I run out of time uh, how GTA Online has become boring or very competitive like uh, you have all the missions spread out through all the map which gives you something to do if you want to do missions but there's not anything in the actual free roam session that you can do to entertain yourself besides drive around cars kill people things like that and I think that's what our problem is in GTA Online everyone kills each other because there's nothing to do so I kind of wanted to get this out there you know maybe you could get a group of friends together and drive golf carts around or you know find something entertaining to do inside the session where you don't have to leave to go start like a mission or anything like that like something inside the actual session that's fun to do now obviously we have things like uh, stunt jumps which give you something to do if you know you need to do stunt jumps uh, you can rob stores those are slightly fun but the cops are very annoying armored trucks cops are annoying um, gang attacks, the gang attack people are OP like aimbot, never miss a shot, spawn kill you as soon as you like spawn in. So that's, you know, I guess that could be fun. Um, you have the crate drops, which those are always fun to do traveling across the map because they spawn like all the way away from nobody and it just... So basically what I'm saying is, if we could create things that would be fun in GTA Online that we all could do where it doesn't have to require a rank or, you know require skill or anything like that that give you something to do that is just naturally fun for everyone I think the online sessions would be a lot more friendlier and easier for people to deal with I've been playing for 30 days and I have only come across like two really friendly lobbies now I plan on posting a video in the future which is up to you guys if you want me to leave a comment in the comment section below it's about an hour and a half long and I'll probably break it into two parts and maybe edit it down depending on what you guys want but it's basically where I got into a lobby with about 12 people it started off with a few of us and it just grew and grew and grew and these were all total random strangers that I became friends with and I enjoyed playing with him we had a really fun time we took over the lobby we didn't cause mayhem to a bunch of people we just had fun and played and enjoyed ourselves for you know a good hour and a half and a little bit longer after that so if you guys would like to see that video let me know in the comment section below I hope you found this video entertaining or informational or give you some plans for GTA online hope you guys enjoyed if you did leave a like on the video and as always I will catch you guys in the next one hope you enjoyed I'm out